Hello and welcome on DDS the R programming channel. Today I will show you how we download and install RNR Studio. First step, you go in your browser and you search for CRAN Download R. CRAN stands for Comprehensive R Archive Network. That's where you can uh, get the R software. Uh, so first thing you will click on R for Windows here and uh, on R, install R for the first time and download R 4.0.3 for Windows or any version that, that you need. So you click on that and a download should automatically start for you. While we wait for that, we can go on and download R Studio. To find R Studio, just type it in your search bar and you'll want to go to rstudio.com, download. Um, we will put the link in the description of this video to help you find those uh, web pages. And when you're on that page in R Studio, you'll want to download the free version here and just simply click on download. It tells you the steps. First, you have to download R, which we're doing right now. Then we download R Studio desktop for Windows. And so you click on that here and the download will start. If you are on Mac, you'll download another version and the same for Linux. Now I will just open this file that I downloaded for the R installation. Then it will ask me, it will ask me, do I want to install that on my computer? I'll say yes, because I do. Uh, my language, I'll choose English and you have to read and accept the terms and condition. And one important thing here is make sure that this is uh, on your computer, somewhere where you have uh, access. Sometimes you're not an administrator on your computer, but if you're you know, a normal user on your computer, not in any organization, uh, not on any like uh, company's computer, you should be able to just install it on your C drive and that will be the best place. If you are in a, working on a company's computer and you have to install it, you will want to do it on your user drive, but uh, try not to install it on anything that it's synced to the web. So OneDrive, Dropbox or anything like that, you, you'll want to avoid installing it there. Now you will go next and um, you will install everything next. Um, I don't need to, to have customized startup. So next and next again. That's just the name of the folder. Now you may or may not want to create desktop uh, shortcuts and then next and the installation will go on. So in this process, it should start to be clear for you. Um, we're installing two softwares, R and R Studio. R is the software that um, you will run in what is called a command line. So you will start to type code in it. And R Studio is a development environment. It's a software that will help you work with R code. Uh, and it has a lot of little features that makes working with R much easier. If you want to know more about getting started on both, you can uh, go check our, uh, our introduction for beginners video. So now R should be installed on your computer and you'll just um, look for R, X, and, and then you should find it. Now I will do the same and, and click on you. So you can either show it in folder and go double click it or just click it here. Then it will pop up and you say, yes, I want to install R Studio. Yes, next. Okay. And, and, and the same story here. You would rather have RStudio on your C drive than anywhere else. Next. RStudio, good. And then it will start the, uh, installing. While in, it, it installs, for it to work, you really, really need to go on our uh, YouTube. And then you have to find the RDDS video and go click on the like button and then you click subscribe here and you click like on the video that you're watching right now. This is very important. Otherwise, our studio won't work. 
Okay, and so it tells us our studio setup has finished. Finish. Once you're done installing our studio, you will just uh, you will be able to open it in any way you open other softwares. In my case, I like to uh, press the window shortcut and then search for it and then enter, and that will bring me to our studio. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.